I don't know about you guys, but I feel a sudden chill in the air. Well, Dexter Loomis has arrived. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Recluse, Wyoming, weighing in at 230 pounds, Dexter Loomis. Just the absolute nothingness when you look into Dexter's eyes, it's horrifying. There are sinister plans at work in this man's head right now. It is impossible to presume this man's intentions. Mind games personified, made real. I just hope Loomis wants to do an interview with Byron after the match. Uh, uh, no thank you, I, I have plans. The Judgment Day is here. And the WWE Universe will feel their wrath. And his opponent, representing the Judgment Day, from Bray County, Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 190 pounds, Finn Balor. Each member of the Judgment Day has been successful in their own right, but together, they might be unstoppable. No brand, no division is safe from the wrath of Judgment Day. Yeah, and here's the scary thing. Others are starting to believe the lies the Judgment Day are spouting. The Prince, the Eradicator, and the Punishment. The Judgment Day has arrived and the WWE Universe is not prepared for their wrath. Well, I sure hope their opponents are. I've always questioned Finn Balor's motives, but there's no mistaking what his intentions are these days. Michael, the selfishness and animosity we've seen from Finn Balor has really put a sour taste in the mouths of the WWE Universe. I understand that he is concentrating on taking care of himself, but I don't think this ruthless attitude is the answer. Yeah, and we have to start asking how far Finn Balor is willing to push this and what his endgame is. But we've got one strange guy across the ring in Dexter Loomis. Sort of an enigmatic powerhouse. We never really know what Loomis is thinking or even what his real motives are. Oh, I'll tell you what his motives are, Saxton. A burning desire to rip his opponents apart. Loomis is silent, methodical, but simmering under that cold surface is a guy who just wants to create destruction. Corey, we talk a lot about the mind games that someone like Dexter Loomis plays against his opponents. Well, that's because his intimidation level can quickly turn the... And he goes for the pin! And there's the kick out. He's nowhere near ready to stop fighting yet. Oh my goodness, what an impactful STO. That hit shaking up the silent, methodical Loomis. And with that move, I'd say Balor's ruthlessness will be key to his success. Pretty drop kick. Shoulders down. He forces a break before the count of two. Close call, but not enough yet. Quick thinking pays off. These two having an answer for everything. There's the sling blade. Basement drop kick. Wow, the chops.
Balor with the kick. Balor on the move. Basement drop kick. He could pin his opponent right here. Barely kicks out. At this point in the match, that could have gone either way. Look at this, just unloading. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Shot after shot, then slamming their face down. Oh, Balor with the counter. Boom. Vicious right forearm. clear he is not going to back down in this fight and he was able to turn that around on Balor oh man right to the esophagus spine buster could lead to a big time win Question here. A good Watch. measure. I think we are witnessing a career altering moment for these superstars, guys. But the spoils will only go to the victor. And I have a feeling we're close to finding out exactly who that will be. Ah, oh, what a neck breaker. He's on his heels a bit now. Well, all things considered, Cole, it's not a bad condition to be in at this point in the match. To the ropes and gets it to force the break. The ropes become a competitor's best friend in desperate moments like that one. Fought back with a punch to the gut. Yeah. Up and 19, 16. Did Finn clinch this? Climbing up to the top now. Finn Bauer up top. Lewis looks out of it. to an end. These gentlemen get after it. Here are the highlights. Here is your winner, Finn Balor. And with the results of this battle plain to see on their face, at least they can say they won the match. The reward definitely seems greater than the risk right about now, but we'll see how they feel once they get back to the locker room and hit the showers.